In this video, I'm going to show you how you can turn this into this using Phrase Express, which you can try for free. In the next 10 minutes, I'm going to show you how I've been using Phrase Express over the last six months, which has already saved me the equivalent of two days I would have otherwise spent typing. And it could save you hundreds of typing hours too, whilst improving the quality and accuracy of your work. Sound good? Let's check it out. So what is Phrase Express? Phrase Express is a type of text expander software that allows you to create templates for your frequently typed text, which can be inserted into any program. It is available for Microsoft Windows, Apple Mac, and iPhone or iPad. A text expander allows you to type in a short abbreviation or custom command text, which the program recognizes and pulls in your predetermined text. As well as sentences or paragraphs, it can also automatically pull in email addresses, signatures, images, and specific links. It is also available in multiple languages. Why should I use it? I already have the Guinness World Record for the fastest typing with my eyes closed. <laughs> okay, so most of us won't be that talented, and Phrase Express is therefore a great way for us mere mortals to work more efficiently. With more and more of us working with computers, it is important now more than ever that we work smarter and more accurately whilst keeping our work-life balance intact. We can all relate to having to type in the same thing over and over again. This includes note-taking, replying to customer sales inquiries, emails, and a lot, lot more. Phrase Express keeps you from having to type in those common texts every time. But what about you copy and paste season pros? This is a good option for one or two items of text that you want to insert a handful of times, but for multiple texts every day it will take a long time to search for the text to be copied each time and then pasted in. And there are other benefits of Phrase Express too. If you have a business, it can help your staff convey a uniform message so that everyone is singing off the same hymn sheet, improving end user experience and consistency of service. The text expansion can also be used as a prompt to remind you of important things to cover or ask. This is especially important for me as an NHS medic to help improve efficiency, safety and medical documentation. But it could just be as important for you, whether you run your own business, are an employee, a content creator replying to your adoring fans or just using a computer at home. So now we know why Phrase Express is useful, let's jump onto the computer and help you get it. It's super quick and easy to download Phrase Express and I've popped a link in the video description box below. It is completely free to try for a period of 30 days, there are no subscription charges and no credit card details are required. After 30 days you can continue to use it as a personal user for free or if a professional you can buy a license for a one-off payment of around £40 or $50. US dollars. Just to say I have no association or link to Phrase Express and they have not asked me to do this video. They probably don't even know I'm doing it. I've just found it really useful and I think that you can benefit from it too. Once you follow the link you'll see these options. I've been using the portable edition as I work in multiple sites and I'm just not that important to have administrative rights to be able to install it on the computer itself. Have a look at the options and check out which one works best for you. Once you've downloaded the program, install it on your device and start it up. Once you've done that, it should bring you to a screen like this. And I'm now going to show you how easy it is to use. On the left you can see the autocomplete section. Autocomplete recognises repeatedly entered words and sentences. You can turn this on by clicking File, Settings and then the Autocomplete subheading. From here you can ask Phrase Express to suggest entered words and sentences. It can also learn individual spelling corrections as you type. In this example you can see after starting to type the sentence for the third time the program has learnt it and prompted me to allow it to autocomplete. It will only autocomplete if I accept it by pressing tab. You can speed up this process by asking it to learn text from emails or text files. You can also prevent it from learning certain taboo words. The next step and the main functionality of this software is to create your phrases. If you're using this for multiple projects, it may be sensible to create new subfolders to keep things organised. To do this, select a local phrase file and then click new folder, which can then be named. Repeat this process for the number of folders required. To create a new phrase, simply select the category and then click new phrase which will bring you to this screen. Enter the description which will help you identify it in the phrase menu, for example it could be your email address which you'd rather not type out each time. Next enter the phrase content, this is what replaces the auto text or text abbreviation which we will enter in the section below. In our example this will be our email address. Finally enter the auto text which will be replaced by its phrase content when executed. 
I would recommend that you use another character in front of your auto text so that your phrase content isn't coming in when you don't want it to. I commonly use a semicolon for this purpose. When you've finished this, you're ready to test it out. Once you've typed in your auto text, it can then be executed by pressing enter, space or tab. If minimised, Phrase Express will continue to work in the background. To find it, check on Show Hidden Icons. Moving on to something a bit more solid, you might want to create a shortcut for a generic letter format so you don't have to type it out each time. Again, set the description. The phrase content can be copied and pasted in from an existing document. You will notice that the date is incorrect. You can set it up so that it will automatically default to today's date by clicking on the date time button and selecting your desired preset. You can also add your electronic signature. To do this, click on the picture and then select your digital signature file. Once the auto text is executed, changes can easily be made as if you'd written the whole thing out yourself. Another way I've found Phrase Express useful is for managing a YouTube channel. When someone's commented on your video, it's nice to be able to take the time to reply to them. You can imagine it would take a very long time to respond to every comment. The basic version of TubeBuddy, a browser extension, does allow you to insert predetermined text with their canned responses but unless you pay for a license you can only add one. Phrase Express can be used to create several predetermined comment replies to speed up this process. It can also be used to easily and quickly promote your video content in your video descriptions, on social media or in your email to your biggest fans. Dear Mum and Dad, As I mentioned before, Phrase Express can be used in any program, and I'm now going to show you how I would use Phrase Express to help me document a consultation for a cough in the clinical system Emus Web. I will often try and document relevant negatives related to a system, so here by typing semicolon chest SX, it then brings up this phrase content. You will notice the contradictory statement which can easily be deleted, as can any other history not relevant or asked during this consultation. Examination findings can be documented by typing semicolon chest, and again this can be amended for the consultation. If prescribing an antibiotic, I will often ask, check and document that they have no known drug allergies to it. It is also important to be specific when giving patients information of when to seek further medical advice often known as safety net advice. In this example, I can type semicolon safety chest to bring this text into the record. This can also be applied to the cough itself. If you've inadvertently added a phrase, it can be quickly and easily removed by pressing Ctrl and Z in Windows. It may save less than a minute per patient record, but if expanded to the hundreds of patient contacts over a week, it soon adds up. To support this, an interesting feature is the statistics section. It calculates the time you've saved by using Phrase Express rather than typing everything out. Using your average typing speed and hourly wage, you can see it suggests I've saved a fair amount of time having used this over the last six months. Over this time, I've accumulated over 100 phrases. When you're getting started, you may choose to keep the desktop menu open to remind you of your auto text prompts. It will take about 30 minutes to get started initially, but you'll soon realize which common phrases you use and these can be added or amended easily as you go. If you're concerned about security, Phrase Express also allows you to set a password by clicking file and then set password. I am aware that some software packages already come with their own inbuilt text expander. What Phrase Express brings to the table is the ability to use it at multiple sites, including areas of your work which may use different software. It also allows a variety of macros to be used and your phrases can easily be changed wherever you are if using the portable version. It is completely free for personal users and can be used on multiple platforms unlike some other text expanders. These are some examples of how I've been using Phrase Express every day at work or home to help me type faster by typing less and improve my efficiency, productivity and quality of work. As I mentioned before, these are just examples. Why not try it out and see what works for you? It's been downloaded over a million times, so it can't be half bad. If you work for an organisation, you may find that you're blocked from installing Phrase Express onto their computers as you do not have administrative rights. There are two potential ways around this. One solution is to use an online storage platform such as Google Drive, Microsoft OneDrive or Dropbox. The other option is an encrypted USB drive, which is what I tend to use as a failsafe as often these online storage platforms are blocked 
blocked by the network. For me, no matter where I am working, I can plug in my USB and open Phrase Express and it's ready to use with any program. The NHS and most other organisations' computers won't allow non-encrypted USB drives to be used. USB drives are fairly cheap to buy and the smallest size one, around 8GB, should be sufficient for most people's needs. If you're looking for an inexpensive encrypted USB drive, I've put a link in the description box below to this Kingston Data Traveller, which is what I tend to use on a daily basis. If you found this video useful, please do like it and subscribe to our channel to keep up with new content we'll be uploading. Please do let me know in the comments section below which ways you're going to use this to optimize your efficiency or if you have any other ways of doing this. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. See you next time. And it could save you hundreds of hours. Phrase Express can save you hundreds of hours every year. And that is done.